Did you know that Laura Bush was a second grade teacher? Way before she became first lady and way before she spoke to the graduating seniors at High Point University. You see, she's taught in an elementary school in inner city Houston. She was inspired to teach there because she had been moved by the stirring words from Martin Luther King Jr. Dr. King once said, life's most persistent and urgent question is, what are you doing for others? Laura Bush answered that question. She taught second grade in Houston for three years. Before she left to go to graduate school, she took a few of her favorite students to an amusement park known as Astro World. One of her favorite students was a nine-year-old boy she taught how to read. When she went to pick him up, he came to the front door by himself. He was in his underwear. He told her he couldn't go. Laura Bush was heartbroken. She gave him an extra big hug and she left. When Laura Bush shared that story with our graduates, she wanted to challenge them. She really challenged all of us. Her challenge involves two words. I'll get to them in just a moment. But first, here's former First Lady Laura Bush and her story about a nine-year-old boy. Never forget that one trip to Astro World, one reading lesson, one consoling touch, one friendly smile, one check written, or one busy hour given to someone who needs you. These are the things that quite literally can make all the difference in the world. We can all make a big difference in someone's life. Former First Lady Laura Bush answered life's most urgent and most persistent question. But can we? What are we doing to serve others? When we answer that question for ourselves, we'll see two words in action, two words, influence and impact. When we serve others, you and I, we have the chance to influence and impact their lives. When we do, we'll impact our own life in the process as well. That, my friend, that is quite the superpower. 